Chi-Chi, I'm home. Hi, Mom. G Goku, H is that really you? <laughs> of course it's me. You look like you've been doing pretty good. You had me so worried. Where have you been this past year? And what's with those clothes? And Gohan, what are you doing in that outfit? Uh, yeah, about that. You know, it's kind of a long story. <laughs> What? You have to train Gohan because you're gonna fight some robots in three years? Yeah, that's okay, right? No, that's not okay! Are you insane? Do you think I'm just gonna let you waltz in here and disrupt Gohan's studies? No, uh, it's, I'm not trying to do that. It's just, well, the Earth might be in big trouble about three years from now. No, I don't care what you say. I'm not letting Gohan train with you. Hang on, wait. You're saying the fate of the Earth isn't as important as Gohan's studies are? Of course Gohan's studies are more important. Nothing's more important than that. What? You don't believe that, right? Come on, let Gohan train with me. Ugh, fine. This is the absolute last time, you hear me? Chi chi. But in three years, he's done with all this fighting. You got that? <sighs> Thanks, Chi-Chi. And sorry. So even Super Saiyans have their weaknesses. All right. Since that's settled, let's go train. Goku! Goku! Can you hear me? Hey, I know that voice. It's Kami! Yep, reading you loud and clear. How's it going? I'm glad to see you've made it back to Earth. I've been waiting for you. My apologies, but would you please come to my lookout? I must speak with you. Oh, really? Does it have to be now? I was getting ready to go train. What I have to say concerns everyone. Everyone? Uh-oh. Got it. Don't worry. I'll be right there, Kami. Good. I'll be waiting. You guys, I'm sorry. But there's been a change in plans. Looks like I gotta head to Kami's place. What do you think? Wanna come with me? Oh, Kami, huh? I have absolutely no desire to speak with him. Gotcha. Tell you what, why don't you guys go on ahead and train without me? Really? Uh, okay, Dad. So, uh, do you know where we're going? Don't need to. I can find you guys just fine. I'll just search for your energy. Are you sure? Go on, get going. Be sure to do your best with Piccolo until I get back, though, all right? Leave the kid to me. I'll whip him into shape. What? Uh... I wonder what's so important that Kami needs to interrupt my training. so important that Kami needs to interrupt my training. All right, there it is. Hey, Kami, Mr. Popo. Long time no see. I've been waiting for you, Goku. Oh, what's up? Well, I have something to tell you about the Dragon Balls. Shenron under the weather or something? No, no. You see, uh, my life is nearing its end. Call it an old man's intuition. What? Ah, uh, no need to dwell on the matter. It's simply a feeling. Uh, if you say so. 
but not all hunches come true, you know. Indeed. But should you have any wishes, let us err on the side of caution and act now. <sighs> Gotta think this through. Got it, Kami! Uh-oh. I'd better head on back now. Piccolo and the others. They're over there. Yajirobe, what's up? Let me guess, you need help with something? <laughs> yeah, you guessed right. Yeah? What is it? Uh, Shinzu beans. Old Corrin's growing a new batch of them. They're still gonna need some fertilizer, though. So I thought that you might be up to the task of getting some. Me? Why don't you do it? Oh, uh, because, uh, because I'm busy. Doesn't look to me like you're doing anything. Y shut it! You and Krillin are probably gonna use most of the Sinzu beans anyway. So why not help a little? Do your part! Jeez! Hmm, I guess you have a point. Man, this guy is so easy. Th that's more like it. I'll tell you what you need to do. All right, then. Take a look. That's the fertilizer I need. It's in the sacred land of Corin. Made it easy for you. I marked where to find it on your map. See here? You'll find it all the way down at the bottom of this tower. All right, that should be enough info. You got it? Yep. See you later. Is he taking a cat nap? Well, Corrin does help me out a bunch with his sensu beans, so I should help him out once in a while. Corrin does help me out a bunch with his sensu beans, so I should help him out once in a while. Yep. What's this? This looks like a great apple. I wonder what Yajirobe does up here all day. Train, maybe? Nah, he doesn't look like he trains. Hmm? Something's there. Want a tango? I'll take you on. Here goes! Huh. I see why Yajirobe was reluctant to do this himself. Well, I can't complain. It's good exercise anyway. Check and check. Yeah! Yep. Yeah! This looks like a great apple. <laughs> we got a keeper. Found some tasty looking food. All right, this looks like it's it.
I got what you wanted! Awesome! I knew you'd pull through, Goku! Just wait right there! Hey, Corrin, look! I got the stuff for you! You nincompoop! You can't pull one over on me! Goku's the one who got it! You're slower than a freaking sloth! Hey, weren't you sleeping? I was meditating, you idiot! All right, I've had it up to here with you. Let me teach you a thing or two. Your punishment will be very creative. Oh, come on, man. I appreciate the hard work, Goku. I'll split these sensu beans with you once they're ready. Thanks a million, Corrin. That took longer than I thought it would. I'd better hurry back to Piccolo and Gohan. from Goku and his friends. Hey, don't compare me to them. you were able to chop off my father's tail. Uh, yeah, I mean, that sort of thing's no problem for a badass like me. Just, uh, uh... Thank you. 
feel kind of bad. The whole time I've been gone, Piccolo's been looking after Gohan. He's even been training him. It sounds like he really toughened him up. So I'm grateful for that. Gohan's taken a real liking to Piccolo. Those two actually make a pretty great team. Training is gonna be great. Can't wait to join them for Seth Bounds and tasty looking food. <laughs> we got a keeper. Yeah. Well, this place seems pretty dull. There aren't many people around. Greetings. we start out with training. All right, for starters, I want the both of you to come at me. Both of us? Are you seriously that full of yourself? Gohan, I want to see you at your full power. Try and catch him off guard and overwhelm him. Okay. Let's see what you two can do. Don't hold back. Oh. Oh. Keep at it! I will, Mr. Piccolo! That's enough, Gohan! You and I are strong, too! he has. Unlike other kids, he's already gone up against the likes of Vegeta and Frieza. Good point. Being here reminds me of when you first started training me, Mr. Piccolo. <laughs> you mean when you were a pathetic ball of tears? What? No, not that. <laughs> oh, okay. I'm starting to get it. So, this is where you guys trained when I was dead, huh? Yeah. Mr. Piccolo was super tough on me. I had no choice in the matter. He was useless to us back then, and I did what I had to do to fix him. Sorry to put you through that, Piccolo. Gohan's a lot stronger now, and it's all thanks to you. And who knows? If he keeps it up, there's no telling how strong he'll get. Might even get stronger than us. Stronger than you two? No way. He'd better. We're gonna be in real trouble if he doesn't. No kidding. And that's why I'm here to help you guys out. Let's show them how strong you can get in three years, Gohan. Y yeah. Speaking of everyone, I wonder what kind of training they're going through. Vegeta's most likely sticking to himself, off somewhere doing his own thing. 
Oh, don't worry about him. I'm sure Vegeta will be fine. He trained in some sort of room where he had control over gravity. I need to access that room. That annoying woman's old man is the only one who could construct something like that. Where is he? Where is that damn geezer at? <laughs> Suit yourself. Do whatever it takes until I'm strong enough to beat Kakarot.
There you are. Yes? Can I help you? What is going on with that training room I asked you to build? Basic construction is complete. I just need a few more items for the finishing touches. Yeah, like what? There aren't a lot of things that can take a beating from you, you know? This thing has got to be durable. Let's cut to the chase. I finish your shopping and you finish the room, that right? That's right, you got it. Here's what I need you to get for me. And that about does it for the things I need. <laughs> you want me to get this, huh? You'll see, Kakarot. I'm going to push myself further than you and become a Super Saiyan. Just any Super Saiyan. I'm going to become the ultimate Super Saiyan, whose power is far beyond yours. <laughs> Easy prey. can think of no greater humiliation than constantly being in your shadow, Kakarot. I'll do whatever it takes to become stronger. Hey there. You a local on this rock? I got a business proposition for you. Give me what you got, and I might not kill you. Who the hell are you? Remnants of Frieza's pitiful army? Are you... Vegeta? W what are you doing here? Oh, I get it. With the Frieza Force gone, you've become a galactic highwayman, too. Sorry, but I got here first, and I ain't sharing with you. You caught me in a bad mood. That will be your final mistake. Die! <laughs> Should be worth 
are more organized than I thought. I got what you asked for. That better be all of it. Now that I have this, the room's as good as ready. Wait here. All right, it's finished. Kakarot trained under 100 times gravity. So I'll have to triple that and train under 300 times gravity. Actually, I wouldn't do that if I were you. Assuming you weigh, say, about 175 or so pounds, that'd be approximately 18 tons of pressure. That's only three times what Kakarot did. There's no way I can't handle it. That Vegeta is unbelievable. Training under 300 times gravity? Is he trying to kill himself? Uh, Vegeta, what are you doing? Shut up, woman. Leave me be. Oh, you don't want my help? Suit yourself. Why? Why can't I reach his level? I... I am the Prince of the Saiyans! Sheesh. There's just no getting through to you, is there? You're insane! Have you been at it this whole time? <laughs> You're not going to make any progress if you keep this up. <laughs> Why don't you just ask Goku what he does to turn into a Super Saiyan? I'd die before I ask for that low-class loser's help! Yeah, then why don't you try dying? What did you say? I've prepared a special training partner for you in the simulator. Think you can beat them? Do you have any idea who you're talking to, you ridiculous woman? You're Vegeta, the almighty Saiyan Prince, right? <laughs> I guess that settles it then. Good luck! And one more thing. My name's Bulma, not woman. Think you can remember that? Do you know who you're talking to? Damn that woman! This place, this is the wasteland where I first fought Kakarot, which means... But how? I'm fighting myself? What the hell? <laughs> Consider yourself lucky. A super elite like myself, wasting his time playing with scum like you. Damn that blasted woman! What the hell is her problem? You're not a little to reach mine! I will get strong! I will go beyond Kakarot and this bastard version of myself! Poof! Show me more! You haven't used it all up, have you? You're a traitor! I have begun to tap into my power! Galaxy! Bear witness to the unstoppable 
will surpass even myself. I will punish myself for lagging behind Kakarot. Wow, I guess that wasn't enough of a challenge for you, huh? You. You really know how to piss me off. Oh, come on. I was just messing around with you. More. Huh? You're right. It wasn't enough. You're going to make me a stronger opponent. Uh, don't you take that tone with me. I'm going to get stronger and use that strength to crush those androids. You have a problem with that, Bulma? Fine. You're a real pain, you know that? Wait. He just called me Bulma for the first time, didn't he? Kakarot, I will surpass you. Just wait. You'll realize that I'm number one. Hey, Chi Chi! We're back! Hi, Mom! Man! We really worked up a sweat today! Goku, do you have a second? Sure, Chi Chi, but can it wait? I'm starving! Don't you? I'm starving me! I got a bone to pick with you! <laughs> Why can't you act more like our neighbors and drive us to the store once in a while? But Chi-Chi, we don't have a car. And even if we did, I couldn't drive it. I don't have a license. You need to get a driver's license. You're the only one around here who still doesn't have something that basic. Piccolo doesn't have one either. What use would I have for that? Then you need to go to driver's ed. Think of it as training to become normal, everyday people! You're both obsessed with training, right? Then you can't say no! What? What do I have to? The next day, after catching an earful from Chi-Chi, Goku and Piccolo reluctantly made for town to enroll in driving school. Now then, shall we begin the driving lesson? <laughs> if this is how it's gonna be, then I'm all in. Listen up, Goku. Whether it's in battle or on the road, I'm not losing to you. All right, I get you. This is a different type of training. It's on, Piccolo! Um, there's no need to view this as a competition. Are you all right? All right, let's do this. Remember, safety first, okay? Not too bad. This, this isn't putting safety first! Uh, don't forget about safety! No, 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 no! Man, this feels great! I bet this thing can go even faster! 
Don't forget about safety! No, 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 no! Woohoo! Don't forget about safety! We should be able to make it, right? Man, this feels great! Woohoo! Time, Goku. Wait! I said wait! A license isn't some prize for bragging rights. It's to ensure that you can drive safely and responsibly. Like I care about that. I will not accept defeat from the likes of him. <laughs> I think I'm starting to get a hang of this whole driving thing, don't you? Let's go, Piccolo. Come on, let's do this thing. Uh, excuse me! With pleasure. It's on, Goku! Oh yeah, Piccolo? Hey, Chi Chi, we're back. Goku, so how'd it go? <laughs> Handled it like a complete pro. I beat Piccolo, no problem. <laughs> you what? I'm not exactly sure what you mean by that, but whatever. Did you get your license? Oh, actually, there's probably something you should know. I think the instructor was a little freaked out by how we drove. She told us she'd give us our licenses if we promised to never come back. <laughs> so... so you... you didn't actually pass the test? Well, well, at least you got your license. Yep. Now we can buy a car and finally go on those family drives I've been dreaming about. Well, the thing is, they also said we'd have to pay for all the damages caused during the test. And I can't even guess how much that'd be. What? Uh, I'm not so good with money, so... I'll let you handle that. Thanks, Gigi. Y you Well, now that that's done, let's get back to training. Yeah! <laughs> Mom? Whoa, Chi-Chi. You all right? I know it wasn't easy, but you finally got your license, Goku. I'm proud of you. Now all we need is a car. A car? Do we even have money for that kind of purchase? Well, not after paying back the city for all of the damages you caused when you were taking the test to get your driver's license. I'm counting on you to get us that car, Goku. Oh, right. I see. Sorry about that. Hey, uh, why don't... 
Why don't I ask Bulma? She's a whiz with machines. Cars are machines. Good idea. Bulma always has a solution up her sleeve. That's true. I guess I'll hit her up about it then. You do that. Oh, hey, Goku. What brings you here? Well, it's not a big deal, but I was hoping you could help me with a little problem. Uh, sure. What's up? Not sure if you heard, but Chi-Chi made me get a driver's license, which is fine, but the thing is, now she wants a car. Got an extra one lying around in those tiny capsules? <laughs> Doesn't that beat all? Earth's champion, now a licensed driver. <laughs> sure, I can get you a car. Seriously? You don't strike me as a responsible driver. Any normal car would turn to scrap with you behind the wheel. Find me the stuff I need, and I'll hook you up with an extra sturdy set of wheels. All right, then. So what do you think we need? It's all on this list. Be sure to refer to it when you're out scavenging so you don't forget anything. Oh, and one more thing. Leave all matters of maintenance and upgrades to me. Excellent. Thanks a lot, Bulma. Don't mention it. After all, happy wife, happy life. I'm home, Chi-Chi! Well, did you get us a car? After I round up a bunch of materials, Bulma's gonna make one for us. Really? That's wonderful, Goku! Then you'd better get to finding those materials. I'm sure it'll be good training, too. I don't know if I'd go that far, but then again, you never know till you try. All right, what should I do today? Dad, mom's calling for you. Really? Uh, okay. Hey, Piccolo, do you think you could take Gohan and train him for a while? At least until I can catch up. <laughs> Fine. Goku, I just got a call from Master Roshi. He said launch is back at Kame House. Oh yeah? Talk about a blast from the past. So what's going on with her? I'm not sure, but he said she wanted to talk to you about something. But I've got training to do. Don't you dare be disrespectful to Master Roshi. Just head over there and hear them out. Oh... Yeah, you're right. Guess I'll make my way over there. Be careful. Well, better get going, I guess. Do what you can.
what you can. Do what you can. Thank <laughs> you. 